Bubba Wallace, the only black NASCAR driver, kinda. <laughs> His... Bubba, you about as black as I am. <laughs> you could probably pass for Mexican <laughs> or Puerto Rican, but black, hell no. You can even be Arabic. Yeah. But uh, wait a minute, but let's get serious on this. Since yeah, dad... let's get serious on this. Let's get serious. You know how I know Bubba? I mean, I've been dealing with that my whole life. Black people been telling me that I'm not black. Yeah, and uh, both my parents are black. Yeah. And what the reason why I don't look as black as some other black people, <laughs> Yeah. my great, great, great granddaddy was from Ireland. Yeah. He was white, by the way. That's <laughs> how so I got the name Hodge. So, I, I mean, I mean, I've been fighting that battle my whole life. Yeah. I mean, if I have a problem with being black and both my parents are black. Yeah. I know you having that problem because your dad's white and your mama's black. Yeah. How the hell did she come with a name Bubba? I know who wears pants in that family. <laughs> you look like a Brent, maybe a Michael or Steve. Yeah. Hell, you could go with Chuck. Yeah, or Charles. Anyway, anything but Bubba. <laughs> Let's get to the story, man. They found a noose in this man's garage. Yeah, it is. I'm going to tell you right now it's a hoax. I don't believe it. Yeah. I think Bubba... Your new name is Bubba Jesse Wallace. <laughs> that sounds black as hell, don't it? That sounds like a slave. At least your damn name sounds black. <laughs> hey, and look this here. is a hoax. Okay, I've been doing a little research. Yeah. I mean, if this turns out to be a hate crime, then I'm not for that. I'm and not saying that. I'm Nobody's. Not, yeah, I'm not down with the white supremacy. I'm not down for hate crimes. Yeah. I'm not down with that, but I'm, I'm telling down. you right here. You heard it here first. <laughs> This is a hoax. Okay, they found a noose. I think it was in this NASCAR, around this NASCAR, yeah. right? Now, Bubba, he hasn't seen it. He admitted it. He has he not had, seen he it. He hadn't seen it. Somebody on his team saw it and said, Whoa, a damn noose in here. <laughs> right? Call the cops. We got Somebody <laughs> call the FBI. <laughs> right? This is a hate crime. <laughs> I mean, is that a hate crime? Yeah, I mean, damn noose. I mean, a hate crime is, it's more like a prank to me, a, a effed up prank. It, it could be a prank. A hate crime is like doing something like what Jesse said happened to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody white, that's a hate crime. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't I'm, know. I got read up on the hate crime laws. <laughs> <laughs> Where I come from, that's a prank. That's an effed up prank, but yeah. it's a prank. It's, yeah, it's true. It's true. It's true. But I digress. At least he didn't beat up himself. <laughs> So he never saw the noose. He's got, yeah. Now it turns out there's pictures, there's video footage of the area yeah. where his car was. And it, it happened at Talladega. Yeah. Raceway, right? And yeah. their garages have these ropes hanging down. Look to, like nooses. They look like damn nooses. Yeah, and there's, there's footage, there's pictures. Yeah. In previous years, every garage has this. And here's a picture of when this happened. Yeah. There's the same rope hanging down, but it looks like it's been cut off or broke off. Yeah. The noose is not there. So <laughs> I'm thinking somebody was pulling the damn rope. It snapped. It's like, yeah. ah, ah. Threw there, it in there. There's and, a small chance maybe somebody on his team. Somebody that he's affiliated, somebody that's close to him, yeah. probably cut it yeah. and played a prank on him, but that's still a stretch. Yeah. You know? Or it could have just broke. Yeah. Ripped or something. If you and asked me. And then he didn't think nothing of it and they just threw it in there. Uh, and yeah. Just, you know what I mean? The FBI's involved in this. Only people has access, access. To, him, to his garage is yeah. his team. Yeah. That shit's locked up. Yeah. It, it couldn't have been some racist fan. Yeah. I mean, how expensive are NASCARs? <laughs> yeah. So it wasn't some crazy racist fan. Yeah, or some crazy leftist broke in his garage. It's locked up. It's under yeah. a video surveillance. It's locked yeah. up. I mean, that equipment is very expensive. You just can't yeah. walk in and lay a damn noose on the yeah. truck. Sorry on for, the car. Yeah, sorry for our skepticism. But Jesse Smollett, he blew it for all people <laughs> <laughs> who had... Supposedly a hate crime. I mean, this stuff is, it's more, uh, it's more, it happens more that fake hate crimes happen yeah. than actual hate crimes. Like I seen somewhere in the South, I forget what state it was, yeah. this black dude painted all kinds of racial slurs all in his restaurant. In his own business. Of his own business to get insurance money. <laughs> I mean, you hear about more fake hate crimes than, than real uh, hate crimes. Yeah. And, and on top of this, he's the only black race car driver mm. in NASCAR. Look at his car. This is a big time red flag for me. Yeah. Anybody 
personally, because what I know about Black Lives Matter, yeah. I've educated myself on, yeah. that's a red flag. Yeah. Black Lives Matter is not really Black Lives Matter. That organization is being used to raise money for white politicians, not for black people. Yeah, Democrat politicians. <laughs> black Lives Matter, that's the only sponsor you could get? <laughs> Why can't you get like Can Two? Yeah, if you were like a black sponsor, you should have got like Sporting Wave, <laughs> or Can Two or, Shea Butter, or the do, the, or the Do Rags, or paint. Uh, you should have painted Kente cloths on your car. <laughs> black Lives Matter. Jesus Christ! Black Lives Matter. You're not matter. even black. Yeah. The <laughs> man, don't be mean like that. People been telling us man, that. Man, you gotta be better than him, man. Man, he but black, man. Man, he but as black as we are. And we black. We barely made the cut. <laughs> I'm only 55% black. Well, according to Ancestry, uh, I just made the cut, though. Yeah. 56% African. <laughs> <laughs> Give me my kente cloth. I'm, I'm still not African. I'm American. Me? Ain't nothing African about me. I'm I a... love this country. Yeah. I'm a true American. Not no damn African, because I ain't from Africa. <laughs> You were born in America. I was born in Monsville, Virginia. We Americans. Yeah. They got a damn racetrack there and everything. <laughs> and I'm going to tell you right now, that whole noose, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Mm -hmm. But I'm telling you, it's fake or someone jumped to conclusions and made a stupid mistake. And one thing led to another. And before everybody realized, man, we jumped to conclusions. That was the damn uh, garage pull down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Go to officialharvestwins.com and pick you out a patriotic t-shirt today. Hell, I'm even giving you 20% off. Just type in discount code Chinese virus. We call it Chinese because it's from China. We making t-shirts great again.